Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, let's have an unboxing of this Redmi 9 Power Smartphone. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you about this unboxing and my first impression. Well, now let's get started into this video, guys. Guys, this is a Redmi 9 Power package and this is uh, from the brand of Redmi. On the rear side of the package, here shows some of the few highlights of the specs. It comes with the 48 megapixel A quad camera setup at the rear side. And then it has a huge 6000mAh of battery and it is supported with 18 watts of force charging support there. Then it has a Full HD Plus display, however it has an IPS LCD panel. And after that it is powered with a Snapdragon processor. Now let's unbox this package. Well, after opening this package and here is a small box and inside this box, so after opening here is a SIM ejector pin. Then this is the redmi 9 power user guide and after that you will get a transparent tfu case so it is full of transparent you will get this transparent case inside the box itself and this quality is also quite good afterwards so here is a smartphone well this is the redmi 9 power smartphone so this is a new design from the redmi and here is having a, a big redmi branding logo it's a rectangular shaped camera module and it has a side mounted fingerprint scanning then it has a u-notch display this package is actually is blue in color and apart from blue color you will also get three more colors so one is the red and then green and then black so you can also choose that also while you are in case if you are ordering mints and afterwards so here is type c cable you so you'll get a type c cable and it has a type c port to charge this redmi 9 power smartphone and it is the 18 watts adapter 18 watts ac adapter so you will get a fast of 18 watts of fast charging support in this device well now let's move on to its product physical overview guys this is the first look of this redmi 9 power smartphone so how do you guys like this design i in my personal view i really like this design and this unique uh, redmi branding huge branding is available and then this uh, rectangular camera module and inside this camera module you'll get a quad cameras so the one is 48 megapixel primary camera which is a AA camera in addition to that 8 megapixel ultra wide angle and then 2 megapixel portrait and macro sensors are equipped well as well inside the rectangular camera module you'll get a led flash too then at the right side here is the volume rocker key and beneath that here is the side mounted fingerprint scanning so there is no fingerprint scanner at the rear side so nowadays all the brands are moving to the side mounted fingerprint scanning so this redmi 9 power is equipped with this side mounted fingerprint scanning then at the bottom here is a speaker grill and then a type c port and then a secondary microphone support then at the top side here is the primary microphone 3.5 audio jack and again another speaker is equipped then at the left side so this is a sim card slot so this sim card slot has supported with the dedicated sd card slot so that means you can able to put a dual nano sim and sd card at the same time overall this redmi 9 power smartphone has comes with the weight of around 198 grams and it has a thickness of 9.6 mm of overall thickness so how do you guys like this new redmi 9 power design so let me know in the comment section below in my personal view i really like this uh, design so these shades uh, so all these different unique things are i really liked so this is the uh, blue color variant and apart from this blue color variant you will also get the red uh, black and then green color model this display has sports with 6.53 inch full hd plus display uh, but this display is uh, based on an ips lcd panel and it has a 2340 into 1080 pixel resolution this display is based on a u notch display and inside the notch you will get a 8 megapixel of your front camera is equipped and after that this display is also featured with the dark mode support and it is also features with the reading mode like that support in this display after the physical overview i just set it up the device after setting up so i have found most of the third party application so like here is a bubble story block puzzle and most of the third party games are pre-installed well now let's check how much of uh, available storage is here so actually this smartphone has comes with the 4gb 
gpf of ram and 64 gb as the internal storage now let's check how much of uh, storage is available well in this storage space actually 18.4 gb is actually equipped out of 64 gb storage so you will get here and in this system storage is 13.43 gb and apk is 24.3 mb and absent data is around 2.6 gb and then others are 2.38 gb so you can uh, in case if you don't need that uh, particular third party apps means you can uninstall that to free up some more spaces and then it comes with the android version 10 so it runs on android version 10 and it is based on mi ui 12 ui so this redmi 9 power smartphone is also comes with a special feature which is recently updated in the miui so that is a floating window so you can able to make a different floating window as like a windows we are doing so that is a good unique thing and it is also a good feature and after that this display is also supported with the dark mode and light mode so i have currently set up this into the dark mode is really good for a better readability well now let's check its camera performance actually this camera's configuration is 48 megapixel a quad camera setup now let's check how its camera works so this is the first camera sample taken in this smartphone so actually as seen here so it is also quite good so it is uh, comes under the artificial lighting condition at uh, this lighting condition it actually works really good <laughs> and this is a one more camera sample in artificial lighting condition too it really works well if your circumstance having a good uh, lighting condition means you will get a good uh, photos in this smartphone well now let's move on to selfie well this is a uh, selfie photo sample so so far in the selfie camera sample is actually also quite good it has actually missing some of the sharpness but however this is comes with the 8 megapixel of uh, resolution so can, we can expect that much only and the color optimization is also too low as you actually seen this so the shirt color is actually very dull actually in real time my shirt color is, is comes with uh, some uh, some brightness too so in the front camera you will get uh, some decent photos not like uh, have some images well we'll share more uh, camera samples and uh, full detailed review in a uh, separate video in the redmi 9 power camera review video this smartphone has been powered with the 6000 mAh of battery as, as you seen here you can't feel like that so it has a 6000 mAh of battery but the thickness of the smartphone is uh, just a 9.6 mm and it has a uh, less weight of a 998 grams only then at the sides you will get a side mounted fingerprint scanning so with the help of this fingerprint scanning you can able to unlock this smartphone so actually the fingerprint scanning speed also too good so just see here just on simple press you can easily unlock this smartphone so the side motor fingerprint scanning is uh, really works well but the thing is in case if you are uh, using the, the smartphone in the left hand means so at that time there is might be uh, some of the issues and uh, after that this smartphone is uh, powered with a snapdragon 662 octa core browser so as per uh, as we are all known is if your smartphone comes with a snapdragon browser means and it has a 6000 mAh of battery so it is one of the best segment in around the 10000 price category segment well what do you guys feel about this let me know in the comment section below well guys that's all about this redmi 9 power smartphone now what do you guys think about this redmi 9 power smartphone whether it is a good smartphone around the 10,000 price category let me know in the comment section below and what do you guys think about this video that also let me know in the comment section below and soon i'll try to post a dedicated full camera review of this redmi 9 power smartphone in our channel soon well that's all about this video guys and hopefully if you guys like this video hit the like button and if you guys like to watch my upcoming videos hit the subscribe button below and thanks for watching this video guys